in this video tutorial we're going to review what is percent of change and I'm going to show you how to apply that to solve two different word problems. A percent of change is the ratio of the change in an amount to the original amount and expressed as a percent. Here's your percent of change formula. In order to find the amount of change, you take the new amount minus the original amount. And it's going to be expressed as a ratio compared to the original amount. Then multiplied by 100 in order to get a percent answer. Here's your example. On Monday, Cynthia fundraised $75 for her charity. On Friday, she fundraised $525. This was the beginning amount. This is the ending amount. Part A. We have to determine if this percent of change represents a increase or a decrease. There's a little typo here that should be is, so the sentence should say, determine whether the percent of change is a percent of increase or decrease. So if she started out in the beginning of the week with $75 and finished at the end of the week with $525, that clearly shows that her fundraising amount increased. So therefore, this is an example of a percent of increase problem. Now let's go ahead and actually find out the actual percent of change. Follow the formula that I had explained earlier. This is your new amount minus old amount and we're dividing it by your old amount, multiplied by 100. Find the difference, $450 divided by 75 will get you six, multiply that by 100, so her percent of increase is 600%. Let's do another example. Six months ago, Steve weighed 195 pounds. Now he weighs 160. Find the percent of change, in this case it's a decrease because he's clearly lost weight, round to the nearest percent. So your setup would be the new amount of 160 pounds minus the old or the original, 195, divided by 195 pounds, the old amount, multiplied by 100. Let's do the math. Negative 35 divided by 195 times 100. I'm going to get this long decimal, and once you multiply it by 100, you get negative 17.9, but I really don't need any other digits after the 9 because according to the instructions, I'm rounding to the nearest percent. The only decimal I need to see is the tenths. Applying my rounding rules, because the tenths value is 9, which is a number that's 5 or higher, that will increase the seven digit in the place value to an eight. So he's lost 18% of his original weight. 